Fantastic, and then, uh... If you think being lesbian is wrong, click the guest quest to debate. We'll get some debates going. But once we get to 500 likes. Again, if you're in the comments and you think that being lesbian is wrong, click the guest request to debate. Alright. Alright, appreciate y'all. Let's get it going. Only join if you do think that being lesbian is wrong. Hello, how old are you? Hello, um, I'm 23, and I just wanted to talk to you. I don't think lesbian is being wrong. I think love is love, and you should really just date whoever you want. Do you agree? I should what? One, one question. Okay. <gasps> Serious. <laughs> Y'all take it easy. Moving on. Uh, if you guys are watching and you think the being lesbian is wrong, click the guest request to debate. Hello, how old are you? Okay. All right. Thank you uh, for the roses. All right. Only join if you do think the being lesbian is wrong. Thank you very much. Again, if you're watching and think being lesbian is wrong, click the guest request to debate. What's up, how old are you? Lesbian fuck. That's, that's what you wanted to say? That's it? Okay, can we get a bunch of F1s in the chat? Again, if you're watching and you think being lesbian is wrong, click the guest request to debate. We'll get some people going. <laughs> Hello, how old are you? Yo. How old are you? I'm um, 20. What year are you born? Hello, how old are you? Yo. I thought I was 20. How you got a major echo, homie. You have to swipe out of the app and then come back. Born in 2000. You're gonna have to swipe out of the app and come back. All right. Again, if you're watching, think being lesbian is wrong. Click the guest quest to debate. If you don't think it's wrong, what's up, bro? Guest quest. Hey, man, how old are you? I am eight to nineteen, but I am on this podcast to say, be who you are. Period, queen. For period. Your Period. All right, on to the next. Appreciate you. Take it easy. <laughs> hey, what up? What up, man? How old are you? Uh, I'm 30. All right. You think being lesbian is wrong? Uh, yeah, because y'all be taking all the women. <laughs> uh, okay, okay. All right. Well, take it easy, brother. Yeah, you too. <laughs> Thank you. All right, on to the next. Only join if you do think that being lesbian is wrong. Please don't join if you don't think it's wrong. Yeah, yeah, he had a good singing voice. What's up? How old are you? Um, I am 15. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just saying as a lesbian. Yeah, you can't, can't you? Bro, you gotta be able to read. You have to be able to read. Please read. I know that it's covered by shit, but I know you can see that. TikTok terms of service. I will not talk to you if you are not 18 and up. Fab, click, uh, click the guest request to debate me. I hate What's up? People. <laughs> I mean, you're a child, so I think you should go read a book. All right, moving on. All right. Well, I, uh, this dude is... Where'd he go? All right. Hold on. He, he added himself back and then he disappeared. For the dude earlier that I echo, if you want to join back in, I got you. Hey. Are you watching right now? Hey, how old are you? Uh, why? Yo, y'all have to be 18 and up. Come on, seriously. It's not hard to read. What's going on? We will get some debates in, guys. I'm sorry. Alright. Move it on, move it on. Alright. Only join if you do think that being lesbian is wrong and you're 18 or older. What is going on today? Do I lift? No. Wish. I wish I did. I should. Um. Only join if you think being lesbian is wrong. Thank you very much. If you don't. Appreciate you, but just looking for debates. What's up, how old are you? Hello? Hello? Yeah, how old are you? Okay. Your sound is, like, you got terrible Wi-Fi or something. Hello? Hello, hold it. You don't, you don't have very good service. Alright, you're gonna have to join back whenever you have better service. Moving on to the next. What is going on today? What is going on? Thank you so much, Hill, for the heart me. Appreciate you. Hello, how old are you? Gay nigga. Okay, go read a book. Thank you. Bye. 
All right, please only join if you think being lesbian is wrong. Apparently, the chi the children are out today. Don't know what's going on today. What's up, Aldi? I'm 19. What year were you born? 2005. You're a liar. Ow. You are lying. What is going on today? It is Sunday. You're not wrong. Shouldn't they be in church though? What's up, Aldi? Okay. What is going on? I've not gotten a single person. This is nutso. What's up, how old are you? I'm 18. 18? What year were you born? 2006. What month? May. Okay. Do you think being lesbian is wrong? Yes. Why? Because that is just wrong. Like, like Why? just. Just date the opposite gender. It's not that hard. Why don't you just date the same gender? It's not that hard. Huh? Why don't you just date the same gender? It's not that hard. Because that's weird and disgusting. Okay, well, I also find it disgusting to date the same gender, so what's the difference? Or the, or the opposite gender, sorry. Uh, wait, can you repeat that? You can't. I find it disgusting to date the opposite gender, so... Like, God made you to, like, date the opposite gender, not the same gender. Yeah, God doesn't exist, little bro. You want to prove God's existence for me? Go ahead. Please, tranny obsessed. You have no room to talk to. You have no room to tell me I'm a little bro, please. You're a tranny obsessed, like... Tranny please, obsessed? Did you just say... Did you just say... You're a tranny. You, you, I'm literally not, but that's fucking disgusting. You're disgusting. You're, you know, your parents did not do well. Oh. Hello. How old are you? 29. Alright, you think being lesbian is, uh, wrong? Uh, yeah, because women can always make me come easier and better, and that's just, that, that shouldn't, that's not fair to men. Okay. <laughs> Appreciate you, take it easy. Alright, only join if you do think that being lesbian is wrong. Appreciate all the friendlies. Just looking for some good right. debates. I'm sorry, I'm sorry for saying the T word, sorry y'all. I, I'm, I r repeat what it, it was, sorry, y'all. Anyways, hello, how old are you? 26. Um, you think being lesbian is wrong? No, I don't, I don't think so at all. You should love whoever you love. Love Period. should be equal. All right, appreciate you, man. Just looking for people that, di to dis that disagree. Thank you, though. All right, on to the next. Hello. How old are you? Um, I'm 13, but please don't let me go yet. I just want to say one thing. No, 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 no. TikTok terms of service. You have to be 18 years old. Y'all, you have to be 18. What's up? How old are you? Strap on up my ass. <laughs> Rub your pussy up my pussy. Okay, 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 okay. All right. Um, F1 to the chat, please, and thank you. Moving on. Okay, bro, I'll add you next if this person doesn't go. Thank y'all for the F1s. If you are watching you think being a lesbian is wrong, click the guest request to debate. Hey, what's up, man? How old are you? Yeah, I'm 18. Wait, what uh, year were you born? 2006, June 17. All right. You think being a lesbian is wrong? Yeah, kind of. Because, like, wait, let me ask you a question. If you were, like, with a woman and, like, every... It was only two of you on Earth. Just you and your woman. How the hell would you repopulate the Earth? What's going on here? So if you and your woman and you were infertile, how would you repopulate the, wor the world? No, if you were like the only two people last, like ever, like living existence. Yeah, you see how, how dumb you your argument, you see how dumb your argument is because I could just use it no, against like, you by using infertile people. It, it doesn't matter because one, it, the hypothetical question is it doesn't matter because I can use the same hypothetical question to ask you the same thing. If you and no, an infertile can't. woman were, yes, I can. If you and an infertile woman were on, if you and an infertile woman were on an island, you also would cease to exist it's irrelevant i do there. i've heard your yeah, argument I'm brother i've heard two, your yes uh, it's i yes and it doesn't her, yes you and your woman yes and if we would man, die we would work something out yeah you would fucking die what um fuck yeah but what if, okay but what if the woman doesn't want to have sex with you what do you mean she has to be so if you the earth, everyone's dying. oh so she's just she's just she's just an incubator for you right no. So that if that so bro, so consent I, is not involved in repopulating the world. 
it's re- it's involved, but not the way you're saying. Oh, like, oh, you, uh, no, 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 no. Because if it's you and another woman, she has to consent to Smex to repopulate mutual, the world with you. It's gonna be a mutual decision. It's not like I'm forcing her down and saying, "Yeah." I'm okay, so what if she says no? Course. So then, okay, so then, what if she says no? Uh, well, I guess we both fucking die, but at least we have okay. a chance. Just okay. A woman, but that isn't that doesn't prove that doesn't it's... prove moral or immoral. That doesn't prove that it's wrong because would you say that infertile people it are wrong because they that it is wrong. It's like you have it, been dude, for a reason. You use it for brother, that reason. You brother, like, brother. What? Make an actual fucking point. So are infertile uh, people wrong? Are infertile people wrong because they can't have children? No. Well, they can okay, so then what's out. the relevant distinction between what's the relevant distinction? If you would let me finish speaking, okay. if you would let me finish, if you would let me finish speaking, what's the relevant distinction between an infertile couple and a lesbian couple? They both can't have kids. So what's the relevant distinction? Go ahead. You can unmute yourself. Oh, my bad. I didn't know I was muted. Uh... They, their thing is still work and they can still do shit. I mean, what still, is the, no, works. no, 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 no. Do you know what infertile means? What is the relevant distinction yeah, between an infertile means. couple? What infertile yes. Means. What is the relevant distinction Look, between infertile an infertile means. couple that cannot infertile, have children? Literally. If you will answer my fucking question, I'm gonna give you five seconds I'm before I'm moving on. To answer your fucking okay, question. Okay. Answer the fucking question. Off. Then answer. When someone's the infertile, it doesn't mean they can't have a kid. It means that like it takes a very, very long amount of time to have that kid. Wrong. They like, cannot have children. Wrong. Well, they have, they, they have, have to use the same cipher. Holy fuck. Listen to me. An infertile I couple an infertile person cannot no have reason. children. Person? An infertile person cannot have children. That's why they use IVF and surrogacy. They have to use alternative means. So. The same things. Look up infertile couples and how they have children. Please go look at it. I, I get you. I get you. Whatever. I get you. I'm, I'm wrong. Whatever. Okay. I can't say anything that can change your mind. It's fine, though. No, it's not Please. about that. Give Please. me an actual argument. Give me an actual no, argument. I can't say anything that can change your mind here. Don't worry. You you good. You good. Peace. Okay. I guess Man, concede. I'm the freaking concede. Concede then. All right. Fine. Bye. It's fucking absurd. Hello, how old are you? I am 20. Alright, you think that being lesbian is wrong? The only reason I think being a lesbian is wrong is because I'm not one, and I'm upset with it. Oh. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Alright, take it I easy. hate being- Alright, moving on, moving on. I know I'm not Parker, y'all. If I didn't look Whoa. like Parker, you wouldn't say I wasn't Parker. So, everybody can be quiet. What's up, how old are you? Jack, how old are you? Nice to meet you. I like the background. Thank you, bro. Twenty-two. How old are you? Perfect. You think being nice lesbian is wrong? Twenty-two. Twenty-two. You think being lesbian is wrong? That's more of a moral question. I think yeah, it's unfortunate. Absolutely. Yes, that people are lesbian. It's unfortunate that people are lesbian. And gay, yes. Mm-hmm. How is it unfortunate that people? You can't say the G word, so use lesbian. Oh, okay, lesbian, lesbian. Yeah, so, so why is it um, there's, there's It's like a two-pronged approach. One of them is they're moving away from what humans are naturally designed to do, which is reproduce, have a family unit, and raise children. What's the definition of and natural? they're also pulling away other people who are... Hold on, 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 hold on. What is the definition of natural? Natural is what God created us to be. That's what oh, God, God. You may have okay. a different definition, but... God, Even in your definition, I'm Jack, right. Jack, no, you're not right. So, prove God's existence, because I don't believe in God. Are you there? Hello? Hello? All right, moving on. Period. Period, Pooh Bear. I am a woman for everybody in the fucking comments that's confused. Y'all could read bios, right? If you just click on the bio, I tell you. Hello. Hello, how old are you? I'm 18. Alright, do you think that being lesbian is wrong? No, I don't. Perfect, alright. I support it. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Take it easy. You too. Thank you. All right. Maybe on only request if you think that being lesbian is wrong. Thank you. I appreciate all the friendlies. I'll do a friendly every once in a while just for morale. What's up, Haldu? Hello. 
What's up, 23? All right, you think being lesbian is wrong? Um, yes and no. Now, hear me out. If So, if women were, let's say, created to have children, and then, obviously, women aren't doing that, then that's the only reason why I think it's wrong. But I think everyone should be able to do what they need to do, and that's it. Do you think that? Do you think everybody should be a parent? If that's within, if if that's what they want, then yeah. If not, then no. Okay, so then you don't even agree with what you just said. But how can you say that? Because you said women are made to reproduce. What does reproducing mean? Having children. If you don't Having think children, what what is that equal? Equal being a parent. And also, women yeah, are not, not created everyone. to. Ha Women are yeah, not, not created, their entire purpose is subjective, but women are not created to just have children. That's a subjective purpose. Yeah, but then people have a choice. People have that choice to whether have kids or not. Doesn't mean you have to be a lesbian. But, doesn't but mean you said, that doesn't mean you have to be a lesbian. What do you mean? Like, the straight people don't have kids, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, if you're a lesbian, right, that's how, that's how you feel whether you're born that way or whether that's the emotional side of it or whether it's through trauma that doesn't matter you know we can have kids right i know you can have kids okay so then what's the, what's your argument so for like ivf and f things like that as well yeah yeah so what's your argument well th this is why we've come up because you're saying why is being nice being wrong when someone agrees with you or doesn't agree with you you then kick them off I think what? Oh, Joe, you're just, you're just trying to pit your ideology onto everyone else. Yeah, right. No, I'm not. I, I've literally asked you for your argument. How am I trying to pit my ideology onto you? I've no, asked you for your here, argument. I'm, I'm not here to argue with you. That's the thing. I'm just saying. Right, if well, this is be... a debate platform. You got on a debate platform. I'm asking for your opinion. Yeah, and I gave you my opinion. And what was your opinion, brother? All you said is women are made to reproduce. I don't agree with that. I think that's a subjective thing. I just proved to you how you don't think everybody should be a parent. What does having children do? That means you, you become a parent when you have a child. If not everybody should be a parent, that just proves it's subjective to the person. So what is your argument? Yeah, but then what's your argument? You're saying what, why is being a lesbian wrong? If you're a lesbian... My argument is it's, that it's amoral. It has no moral significance. It's not wrong or right. It doesn't matter just like heterosexuality. That's my but argument. Then, but then that's what I've come up because I said yes and no. So I've given you the fact of, you know... You this can't... That's a contradiction. You can't say yes and no. That doesn't make any sense. But you've just agreed with what I've just said. You've just said... No. That it's not morally right or wrong. It's uh, amoral. So. It has no moral significance. You said yes and no, it's wrong. So why, why yes is it wrong? I don't believe that it's... I don't believe that it's wrong, but I also don't believe... It. All right. Toodaloo. And he was a fairy. How old are you? 18. What year were you born? 2005. What month? March 15. Yeah, that would make you 19, brother. That would make you 19. Toodaloo. All right. Sorry, y'all, it's been a minute. <sighs> Moving on. Bananaed for a week. Thank you for the roses. All right, taking too long. Moving on. All right. Hello, how old are you? Hey, what's up? I'm 19. Uh, April 2nd, 2005. All right. Um, honestly, I don't think like, I don't think it's wrong to be lesbian. Uh, okay, cool. But, well, I am just thinking of people that do think that it's wrong. Oh. Well, I just want to say, like... Well, if you don't think it's wrong, then no debate. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you so much for the superpower. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. All right, moving on. Hello, how old are you? Hi, 45. All right, do you think being lesbian is wrong? Um, I, I agree that it's morally wrong. Okay, but, well, it's sh morals are subjective, right? And it depends on somebody's belief system of where they look 
to their moral compass. So mm-hmm. I, I'm re- I was listening just for a little bit and I couldn't help but to wonder, why do you care what people think about that? Or why do you want to debate people? Is it to change uh, their mind, maybe? Or Yeah, because, uh, so, one, I am a lesbian, but two, because there is an insane amount of religious people that persecute this community, and there is set, it's still 68 countries where it's completely illegal in, and this is a big platform, which means I can reach people in different countries and change their mind. Um, and I want to have intellectual conversations about things that people think are immoral when they've just been told something's immoral, they don't question why it's immoral, and I think that's illogical and idiotic. Yes, I agree that people are persecuted. I, I, in other countries, it's, it is illegal. They will yeah, be and until 2015, we weren't we yeah in 2015 we weren't legally allowed to get married, which is not that long ago. Uh, right. And there's there's still a lot um, there's still a lot of persecution from the Christian Church. I live in a southern state, and there are fucking like some major major churches here that say some horrendous shit. I I disagree because I'm also in a southern state and. I think the vast majority of people that are um, religious or believe in some religion don't, yes, we believe that it's morally wrong because we look to God for our moral compass. So, but are you we religious? don't care. Yes, ma'am. I'm a Christian. You, no, you can't speak for nobody. all. You can't speak for all because what happens at pride events is when we don't come to your church standing outside of your church, but you know where you go? Churches stand outside of pride events and scream at people mm-hmm. that they're going to hell and, and put fucking mm-hmm. pamphlets on people's doors that they're going to go to hell. So, I mean, like, I can you see can't how speak that, for all. I can speak since i've been a christian my entire life and i've never experienced anything like that and all is welcome and yes because you are not a part of the community of course you wouldn't experience it i am a part of the community and i experienced it within the church well we have a couple that comes to our church so i don't give a shit i don't give a shit that's anecdotal experience i don't care for it thank you so so much for the roses kylo so you just want to focus on the small percentage of the crazies it's it's not the small that doesn't represent christianity Christianity as a whole Okay, you want to talk about the no, seven hundred? You want to talk, no, Kelly? Kelly, do you want to talk about the seven hundred thousand adults and the six or four hundred thousand kids that went through conversion therapy because of because of Christianity? Do you know what conversion therapy is? I told you I'm not denying that awful stuff has happened. I'm not denying Kyle, that. Thank you so much for the awful meaning, right? stuff has happened to them in the Christian community and outside the Christian community. You guys make up the majority. You make up 88% of the, the Congress. Like, you make up the majority. You can't be oppressed. So, I don't really care. So, what's your argument here? Is that you believe that being lesbian is wrong because of God? If, if what you say... 88 we make up 88 percent there would never have been same-sex marriage there would never be this democrats um, fought for it it's still it's majority that's how it works it doesn't matter if you fight for it or not republicans fight for things too that they don't get anyway i'm not going to put myself in I, I, um, I've politics as crap so i've this asked is you not really I, this i've is already a- i've already asked you if you think that being lesbian is wrong because of god yes Okay. Thank you so much, uh, love. But um, we don't but I don't hate anybody and it's none of my business who you choose to love too. That's you my chose to come up it. here. You chose to come up here. So you obviously wanted to share your opinion, correct? Thank you so much for the heart me. Actually I just came up here because I'm like, why does she care what other people think? And those places Because you're that because the community to be that is not Christian um countries. Those are not christian countries at all that's mostly hey guess what they believe in yeah guess what they believe in jesus not not, they believe in jesus are you are you kidding the muslims don't believe in jesus kidding you don't know and you don't know what you're talking about oh yes i do no Um, you don't jesus thank you so much for the man thank you for the heart me that was a prophet that wasn't anything but a man that is not what believe in jesus they don't believe in Jesus. He's just a mere prophet that they misrepresent in their Quran. Okay, so, that's no. your opinion. That's your opinion. That and is so not you, my opinion. That's that facts. is your opinion because you can't prove that Jesus was re- resurrected and you can't prove that he was the son of God. Go ahead and do that for me. 
Ma'am, you just prove that Jesus claims. was the Son of God. Tr- I prove that Jesus I was the Son of God. I'm up here to prove to you my beliefs. Okay, then why the fuck are you here? How you're gonna, gonna you're gonna you're gonna talk you? about morality. You want to talk about morality? How are you gonna prove that to me? How are you gonna believe in something you can't prove to me? Listen, how did you jump from Islam to back to Christianity when you said nonsense about Islam and then jump no, back didn't. to Christianity? I, yeah, because like, let's work on facts Hold up, here Kelly, did you just did, Kelly, anywhere. did you just come up to defend your your religion because you were feeling a Thank little bit so hurt? Where did you just come no, up to, I'm not hurt. to preach, was, or did you I, want to talk about the topic at hand? No, I came up here to ask her. Thank you for the roses. What does she care what people think about her lifestyle? And anyway, she told no matter you, if you're sitting here and gaslighting an entire community who faces condemnation every single day of their lives. But you can't get mad trust. at me because of my moral compass no more than I can be mad at you about yours. What? Is the point. Okay, so explain to me how sexual orientation has anything to do with morality. Because if you're a Christian, or some people that are not even Christians or atheists, don't believe it's okay. So I don't well, know. No, people- no, no. You can't just say, well, because other people say it's it's not okay. That's yeah, like if Timmy's going to go, you know, jump off a bridge, are you going to too? So in what? your own innate morality, explain to me how sexual orientation is immoral. Because it's laid out. For it's us. not so, laid. It's not want- laid out in the Bible. It tells you that it is immoral, but I'm asking you why it's immoral, and you have yet to tell me why. Because I am a believer. Yeah, so you know what's hilarious? You know, it's funny. So uh, thank you for the hand art, TJ. So in the same book that it condemns homosexuality, it condones slavery in Leviticus. <laughs> I'm glad you want to laugh okay. about I'm glad you want to laugh about that. Okay. I just laugh at, at just the, the sheer, just delusion of you're telling me things about my religion that is and shoddy i was a, i was a christian for 20 years you. i have hebrew tatted on my fucking neck i know the bible back and forth you don't act like you know me ma'am you wouldn't have said what you said if you know the bible back and i do forth. know really do you want to read you want to read leviticus and exodus you want to read the, the new testament where it talks about slavery and how to own slaves and how to beat your slaves you want to talk about that kelly if, you want to talk about that want- if you Let's talk about talk that because about your God made it very fucking clear. You know your God clear made it there. very that your God made it yes. very fucking clear. Kelly, let me finish. Your God made it very fucking clear that you can't mix fabrics and you can't eat pork. But you know what he didn't give a fuck about? That you couldn't own people as property. In fact, he told you how to fucking do it. So make it clear, Kelly. You make it have, clear. You don't have a clue. You I do. You want me to read it to you? I have a I have a fucking clue. And so do all the theists and the atheists need, that talk about the slavery in the Bible. You, you're, you you're a hypocrite. Understand. You're a hypocrite. No. You have no idea what you're talking about. You have no idea what you're talking about. I'm a hypocrite. I do not. Yeah, you want to get your and others. your, but your it God actually, does. Your yeah, God does. That's why, he, that's why he yeah. he tells them what's gonna what should happen to them legally if he, they kidnap anyone. What? You don't know the difference between chattel slavery and the yeah, slavery and it, yeah, that they're I do know. About chattel slavery is for no indentured servitude was for six years. In Leviticus it wasn't talking about indentured servitude because indentured servitude doesn't refer to people as property for life. You don't know what you're talking about. So and is I that why do. you're mad at God? I'm not mad at God. I'm mad that your morality stem, stems from something so immoral that it's heinous. It is heinous that you would get your morality for something like this. And that's what I'm mad about. It's just ridiculous. You And you're also denying something that's straight from your book. I'm not denying anything. I'm denying your understanding of what yeah, you're talking about. Hold on, about. hold on. Kelly, can we, can we hit the pause button? Did you come yeah, up I'm here to? Done did, anyway. No, no, no. Um, did you come up here to personally attack the host um, and then deflect from every single question you've been asked, or did you come the up host, here to debate? Do you feel personally if not, attacked by if me? If not, I think you're not answering a single fucking leave. question that I've asked you. I, I answered the question. If you don't like the no, the you answer, laughed when I, I talked. No, how, I, 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 I. Do you want me to read you Leviticus? You do you want me to read you Leviticus? Do you want me to read you Leviticus? 
Let's All right, your male, Leviticus 25, 44 through 46. Your male and female slaves are to come from the nations around you. From them you may, you may buy slaves. You may also buy some of the temporary residents living among you and members of their clans born in your country, and they will become your property. You can bequeath them to your children as inherited property and can make them slaves for life, but you must not ru rule over your fellow Israelites ruthlessly. And then let's, let's go over to Exodus 21, 20 through 21. Anyone who beats their, ma their male and or female slaves with a rod must be punished if the slave offs as a direct result, but they are not to be punished if the slave recovers after a day or two since the slave is their property that's not indentured servitude and okay, you would know so. that if you knew what indentured servitude was and the difference between the different contexts of the situations in the bible so this is the thing so when you're reading these texts you have to rightly divide the text and understand it as a whole and that's is it the same fucking god doing. okay so you so you have to you have to look to your church that to was interpret a it different it, world. it's pretty heinous if you read it on your its god own. allowed it to happen but made sure to let you know that hey you can't mix fabrics and you can't eat pork or or uh shellfish I don't give a fuck. You're not making a single point here. Your God is allowing and condoning slavery and allowing it and telling you how to do it. And if you're slave, if you're a slave, is to be beaten. They can only be beaten if they in the, if they survive after two to three days. And you won't be punished if they survive after two to three days. You're not listening to me. You're a Christian apologist. Um, what if they? What if they? Um, are you condoning what's happening in the Bible? Are you condoning what's happening in the Bible, Kelly? Are you condoning? You are you condoning what's happening in this? Are you condoning uh, what's happening, Kelly? Are you? Are you Kelly, okay with them Kelly, them at are you or Kelly, Kelly, it's are you like condoning? Are you condoning the slavery in the Bible? Are you condoning the slavery in the Bible? Is that what you're saying right now? Listen, it's not up to me to condone anything. Okay, this is, but this is the God you believe in. This is the God you believe in, right? Listen, these are stories, and are they not they are they not accurate in your worldview? If you knew when Jesus came, if you knew the Bible like you said, yeah, the I do know. Laws are, yeah. are not yeah, in so God, anymore. Hold, no, and actually, also, no, 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 no. You're not going to sit here. You're not going to sit here. You're not going to sit here and preach. First of all. Um, You'd have to prove that Jesus was real, so I don't believe in this shit anyways, but uh, let's talk about Jesus, okay? So God came down as himself in human form, as a loophole for his own rules that he created. He could have just forgiven you. He didn't need to come down as himself and, and sacrifice himself to himself as a loophole for his fucking creation. It's, a, it's obnoxious. Not only that, but your whole salvation depends upon his his account of resurrection, which we have nothing for, except for the Bible. You'd have to prove that the Bible is true to do so. We have no accounts of Jesus' resurrection outside of the Bible. So you have to go and prove that. But the entire idea that God would come down as himself, sacrifice himself as a loophole for his own rules that he created, is just idiotic and illogical. So I don't give a shit about Jesus, and I do know the Bible. I know what Jesus did. I know all about it. It doesn't fucking matter. When you actually think critically about these things, it doesn't make sense. God didn't need to use Jesus, come down as himself in human form to forgive us. He had the ability to do so, but he chose not to. It's illogical, idiotic. But anyways, I'm moving on because you don't know how to have a conversation. All right, moving on. Hello. Hello, how old are you? 19. All right, do you think that being lesbian is wrong? Absolutely not, because... Okay, period. Right, I, in my I, opinion, like this is literally just my opinion now. What other people are doing is nothing got to do with anyone else. Like, I mean, unless they're harming people, but other than that. Yeah, unless All right. they're like harming anyone, then we kind of got to step in, but yeah. got to do I, like. Yeah, I appreciate you, but I am just looking for people to debate, but I do really appreciate you. Thank you. Hey, no matter, I'll give you a follow there now. I appreciate you. Take it easy, okay? All right, moving on. Hey, how old are you? I'm oh, 49. All right, brother. You think being lesbian is wrong? Uh, yes. How come? Uh, what is the point of being with someone? Uh, love and companionship. Love and companionship. Yep. Um, also, what else is um, out of that love and companionship? What else uh, comes out of that love? Uh, it depends on the subjective purpose of somebody's goal in life. Okay. Um, so if you love someone which, you know, hopefully you do, which that's good. Um, out of that love, what do you want? What is the, um, 
end result of your love. I think what uh, you're trying to get at, I think what you're trying to, to get AG to um, say is that... Uh, children, but I right. would say that's subjective, and I don't okay. care for that. So, all right, but okay, so that's good. You, you're not, you don't want children, but... No, if she didn't you, say that. I didn't say you, that. I said that that's irrelevant. It's subjective okay, to the person. Well, and you like can agree with... You, and hold on. I bet you'd agree with me because I bet you'd agree that not everybody should be a parent. Thank you for the roses. Well, not everybody should be a parent. Okay, but, so then that goes know, against... That literally contradicts what you just said. No, it's just... Yes, that it does. That, whether, you, no. whether you want to concede to that or not, what does reproduction lead to? Parenting. And if you don't think everybody should be a parent, then not everybody should have children. But that's again up to those individuals. Some people they say yes, they don't want to be a parent. Yes, again, it's subjective. It's again, subjective. You don't like know I said, who, again, you don't know who wants to be a parent, who don't. Some people, yes, and I met subjective. many people. Many people but say they don't point. want to be parents. Well, my point is, if you know, if it was okay, then they will find a way for you to reproduce. We have ways everything. To everything. Everything in life has a way of. Thank you so much for the, for the reproduction roses. itself. Yeah, we have Animals ways to reproduce. It. Animals do it. Hey, um, if you're just getting to get up it. here, hey, dude, dude. Yeah. You are just yapping. Make a point and stop. Well, you're just yapping. I'm, well, I'm saying that. Yes, and we have ways to reproduce the same way that an infertile couple can reproduce. How? IVF if surrogacy. You, IUF, no, 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 IVF. No, no, no. You depend on somebody else. Is that not if reproduction? You and your mate, you is it, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. So are you saying that the straight and fertile couple is wrong for using IVF? That's because they, for some reason, uh, maybe because of health reason. Yeah, um, and, that, and, that, and, 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 and that's a great, right? Because they can't choose that, right? And I can't choose my sexual orientation. So I didn't choose to, to only be attracted to women and not be able to have children other than using IVF. I can't choose that. You can't choose who you want okay. to go with. That, n no, 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 no. You can't choose your yeah, you sexual. Can. You can't. You can't choose your sexual orientation. If you'd like to bring, if you'd like to bring me a source that says you can choose your sexual orientation, that'd be great. Go ahead and swipe out of the app and find me a study that says sexual orientation is a choice. Again, at um. Uh, nope. Nope. Resources. Nope, no, nope, I'm just saying nope, resources nope, can be. Nope. Swipe out of the app. Find me a find me a source that says sexual orientation is a choice. I'll be waiting. You're not teacuped, brother. Leave the app. Find me a source that says sexual orientation isn't a choice. Is a choice. I'll be waiting. <laughs> I, like I don't you. care. Hey, brother. I don't care for your opinion on it. I'm asking you to bring me a source. So uh, bring me a study. Bring me a, If you don't bring me a study, I'm going to kick you. You need to bring me a, st a source that says sexual orientation is a choice. It's you can have your, why would you want your opinion to be wrong? Do you want to no, believe in my, things that no, are true? I'm just saying that there hey, are people... Do you, do you want me... Hold on, are stop talking. Are discussion or are you just going to talk over me? I'm trying to let no, you know No, because you won't... You will not bring no, me a source. I, I, bring like me I a said, source. Bring like me a I said, source that says sexual sources, orientation is a choice. There are sources are depending on... Because they always change. Life is always changing. So no, at so one time... Bring me, said black, bring they, me a one, source... Bring me a source that says sexual orientation is a choice. Thank you very much. We will all be waiting. Thank you very much. Thank you, go on for the GGs. You're so relaxed. I don't know why you're not teacup, Tommy. You literally should be off the app right now looking for something. I don't need to look for something. All right. We're moving on. Thank you very much. Have a great day. If you can't have an actual intellectual conversation besides just spewing your opinion and you can't bring up sources, then you're booted. Toodaloo. Fine, bro. Hello. Hey, how old are you? I'm thank you so much 25. for the GGs and thank you for the um, roses. How old are you? Or, uh, sorry. Uh, do you funny. think being lesbian is wrong? You're I'm good. I heard you. Sorry. Uh, do you think being lesbian is wrong? Um, I do, but I also feel like it's okay to be wrong. Like, I truly believe in God, and if you like, if you're, if you haven't been connected yet to God, and you don't like, you don't really like know God that much. It's okay to be wrong in in, in this sin, you know. But I feel uh, like maybe like 
if you understood God and like, or if you maybe like look for God a little bit more and stuff like that and try to uh, follow like morals and stuff like that, you'll realize. Yeah, so the morals in the Bible are heinous, so I don't really care. So can you prove God's existence? Uh, yeah, I feel like, I feel like I can. Like, I mean, I feel like I personally, I, I don't know how I could prove to you God is real and like without. I don't know. I just wanted to say, like, I just wanted to say, like, maybe you should. You should hey, uh, I was a, I was a Christian for twenty years. I have Hubert tatted on my neck. I am an atheist now. Mm, why did you turn into atheist? Um, because there's no evidence backing a God, and then if you just read the Bible, you should shut it because the Bible's and it contradicts there's, God. There's, there's lots of contradictions in God's existence. Um, not only that, but it's just there's no evidence beyond that. And I want to believe as many true things as possible and things that are backed in evidence. No, there's so, a lot of evidence, historical evidence. There's, there's not to back up a supernatural being. There's not. But if you'd like not. to present with me, present me with some. Go ahead. There's a lot of historical evidence of Jesus. Run being, it. Like run it. Wait, before like before because when Run i say it. jesus when i say jesus you're thinking of this magical person i'm nope. saying like there was historical evidence of a man named jesus walking. yes through, that right? doesn't prove that jesus was the son of god or that god is um supernatural okay well so i, uh, I don't really i don't know. i can give you i can give you that jesus may or may not have been a real person i don't really care for that that doesn't prove that he was a supernatural being or the son of god you would have to prove that he is the son of god and you'd have to prove that he's supernatural and you'd have to prove god's existence all in one so go ahead uh, i don't know I just, I just wanted to say i just wanted to say that like but I... nobody can hear you there's not much else i can tell you like if you didn't know about God, then I would tell you to like look in the Bible or like talk. Try yeah, to I, yeah. You you want to know why? You, I I know the Bible, homie, and I would never ever ever get my morals from it because it condones slavery, it condones mass genocide, it condones offing people, innocent people, uh, grape, it condones uh, hor horrendous fucking shit. So I would never get my morality well, from. Well, no, the you're talking about Christianity. I'm talking about the Bible because you're talking about Christianity That's, being a, being. I'm a, talking about the Bible. No, I'm, I'm literally about, I'm talking about the Bible. Christianity believes in the Bible. Christianity is a group of people that believe in Christ. I'm talking about the source which where, is and the, where would you get Christ from? The fucking Bible. Okay. No, I mean that was my whole thing. I just wanted to come in here and maybe tell you about God, but since you already know I already I already know. You did not I literally do you, I already I literally read the Bible to people up here. Oh okay, no, there's nothing else then because I mean if you don't uh if you don't believe in God, there's not much else I can do. You can't tell me why something is immoral without God? What do you mean? I'll give you a great example. So PDFs are not in the Bible. How do you know PDFs are wrong? PDF. Oh, uh, cause that's just a moral thing. Like you just know that it's wrong. It's like in your heart and you, your You just know, you just know. So why do you know that it's wrong? Because it's like a moral thing that we know, like a feeling. Like I feel like when you're born, you kind of already know what's wrong and right based on like the feeling of it. Like if you thank you so much for the. Right. If you see something like bad. If you can't substantiate why you have morals and tell me why something is immoral, then like you're just a sheep. If you're just told things are immoral and you have a feeling something's immoral, but you can't go down the line of why something is immoral, then why would it's I trust you in from, saying that being lesbian is wrong? Else. Okay, great. That's great. All right. So tell me how being lesbian is wrong in the same sense. I guess I mean you're right. You're not hurting anyone. You're not hurting anyone. And that's why I said it's like I guess it's not wrong. Uh, I just um, I don't know. I just wanted to. That's that's my whole thing. I just wanted to come in here and maybe tell you about God. But since you already rejected him, you think nobody? You think you do? You think God is new? Do you think there are people that haven't heard about God? No, nah, but real? you obviously like rejected him. Like uh, I followed him very closely for the majority of my life, and I have literal I have literal Hebrew tatted on my neck. Which is was what the original like Bible was written thing? in. Was there a specific thing that made you like a atheist, or like was it specific? Uh, yeah. So uh, Christopher Hitchens, the problem of evil. Oh, I couldn't. Dis I couldn't dispute it. No, he's an atheist. Oh, okay. He, okay. he gave me an argument I couldn't dispute, and then I just kind of started what reading was the argument. The problem of evil. So you can't have an all good God and evil at the same time. It contradicts itself. And contradictions cannot exist. Okay. I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I, I didn't come here to argue. I just Thank wanted you so to... Thank so much for the GG. All it's right, well, appreciate over. you, man. Take it easy. Right. Move it on. All right. Yeah, y'all, for everybody saying um, that evil came from Satan, guess who created Satan? God did. Y'all are hilarious.
Yeah, everybody tells me I look like Parker. Thank you for the roses. Appreciate y'all. Thank you, Timothy. Alright, moving on. This person's not loading in. Alright. Hello, how do you? Hey, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I'm listening to your conversation. And I want to tell you, as a Jewish woman, when people come up with the Bible um, to you, make sure that they know that that segment in the Bible um, where it says a man shall not lie with a man. It's mistranslated. I wish they cared, but they just don't. Because okay. they've been, they, they just don't. I'll use it occasionally, but um, that's why I use like the PDFs. But they just don't care. I don't know what it is. They don't care that it was mistranslated in 1946. Okay. I just wanted but, to make sure you knew that. Yeah. I do. I've tried to use it. They don't care. They go, well, I still think you it's know, wrong. You're not going to convince, you're not going to convince people if they're dead set. You know, the, the problem yeah. is with the Christian right is they live in so much fear that they can't listen to another person's, um, they can't even hear another person's view point, point of view. They have to run away because it would challenge they their, it. It, it would challenge and, and break away their, that bond they have, that mental you know, yeah. and they're afraid, totally agree. They're so afraid of going to hell that the pastors and their churches have them under, you know, put under their thumb. Thank you so much. I, I totally agree with you. Uh, I appreciate you so much, Mama J. Take it easy, okay? All right. You be safe. You too. Okay. Thank you so much. W Mama J in the chat. What a sweet woman. All right. All right. All right. Moving on. All right, and she was a fairy. Hello, how do you? Um, like, sorry, I accidentally sent this request, but like, uh, I'm actually under eighteen, so like, can you? Oh, me okay. Out? I'm sorry. Yeah, I got you. Appreciate you. Take it easy. All right. What's up? How old are you? I'm 43. What year were you born? Uh, 1981. Okay. You think being lesbian is wrong? Um, I have lesbian friends. I mean, that depends. For me, for me, it depends. If you follow the Bible, then it's going to be wrong. But if you follow, I mean, it's objective, I think. I mean, I, I just want to ask, and I'm curious. Um, do all lesbians have gender dysphoria? No. They don't. Okay. I don't think it's wrong. I don't think it's wrong. Sweet, Anyways. brother. Take, take yeah, it easy, man. One. Thank you. You too. Thank you. All right. I got the I got the Christians wrong because I got a bunch of pastors in my I got a bunch of pastors in my guest requests. What's up, man? How do you? Hello. Eighteen. You are not eighteen. I'm eighteen. No, you're not. Do not lie to me. Hello. Hey, hi there. I'm 50 years old, born in 1974. Sweet. Do you think that being lesbian is wrong? Uh, only if you believe that being Christian is wrong. Only if you believe that anybody who has had an affair on their spouse is wrong. Yeah, like, I mean, because everyone wants to throw Christianity at this. So, I mean, I'm going to tell you, I'm a 50-year-old gay man, okay? Period. Masculine gay man. People don't believe me when they find out I'm gay. They're, they're shocked, but... Say, uh, say, say, uh, say GAY TikTok hates us. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, no, no, it's okay. You don't better. know. I do. I know. No, I do way too many lives. I know better. <laughs> sorry. My bad. No, it's no, okay. Everyone really. wants to throw the, everyone wants to throw the Bible at this subject, but yes. nobody wants to throw the Bible at, uh, you know, everything else that we do that the Bible says is wrong. So, I mean, I just want to come in and say, Hey man, li live your, live your life. You know, I mean, yeah. To hell with what other people say is right or wrong. If it's right in your eyes, 
And if it's not wrong in the in the letter of the law, then live your life. Yeah. I appreciate you, man. Take it easy, okay? Hey, no problem, man. Have a great day. You too. Thank you. Oh. All right. Oop, there we go. W guest in the chat. Hope you have a great day, man, for real. All right, moving on. Thank you for the heart me. I'm not doing it. No, Jay. Yeah. I love Oh. And she was a fairy. Moving on. Hey, how old are you? Thank you guys so much for the roses and the heart me. Hey, how old are you? Hello. Hey, how old are you? Me, I'm 46. All right, you think being lesbian is wrong? No. Period. I believe, Have a great day, man. I, I, I believe people need to stop judging people for what they want to be. Period. God Take didn't create us to be one specific thing. I actually oh, I don't. I, I, I believe in God, but I don't follow religion in any set format. Because I, I believe you. part of it's right, but most of it's wrong. I got because you, Because I don't see God... Everybody says, see God as a theory, uh, God should be feared. Why would God want to be feared? Why should God be feared when he wants, to, well, wants us to love, be together, understand each other, do good by each other, and have set standards so we don't hurt each other? Yet, we do it every day by creating laws that try to say people who are lesbians shouldn't be together or gay shouldn't be together. Shouldn't have same sex marriages, which is completely wrong because at the end of the day, you are who you are. You can't change that. So why should you? I appreciate you, man. Well, I am just looking for people to debate, but I, I appreciate you, man. Take it easy, okay? I appreciate it. Take care of yourself. You too. Thank you so much. Super sweet guy. Moving on. What's up, how old are you? Hey, what's up? I'm from South Africa, I'm 29 years old. I'm a business owner and I just thought I'd come on here and tell you you're doing an amazing job because you're really promoting you. the community and I genuinely believe that everyone should leave everyone alone if it doesn't affect them. I appreciate you, man. Thank you so much. I ta you uh, take it easy, okay? You too, bye-bye. Hey, I hope your business goes super well, okay? Uh, thank you so much. I appreciate you, man. Take it easy. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you so much for the heart means. Thank you so much for the um, roses. Tell your guests in the chat. All right. Moving on. Hey, how old are you? Hey, hello. Thank you so much for that. Do you think that being lesbian hello. is wrong? I'm 38. All right. Do you think being lesbian no, is wrong? No, but I'd like to offer a certain perspective that most people don't think about if that's okay. Okay, go for it. Sorry, I'm having a bit of technical issues here. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Can you cool. hear me? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you good. I just had an echo for a second. Sorry. Okay. So just a small brief caveat, and then I'll get off the live because you really want to debate people. Okay. And uh, I come from, uh, I'm Jewish, come from the Jewish religion. Um, and I just wanted to offer two little caveats out of what my understanding is of the approach of the Jewish religion towards this subject. And it's something that most people don't know. Okay. And I don't in any way, shape or form speak for all Jews. I speak from my understanding. Okay. Okay. So two points. Point number one. The reason that G-A-Y sex is supposedly forbidden on the Jewish principle is that it has to do with the male seed. The male seed is considered sacred and it is not to be wasted, which is the main principle of why uh, G-A-Y sex is forbidden, which okay. has nothing to do with lesbians. That's point number one. Point okay, number okay. two, and that's a very basic principle in Judaism, is the principle of tikkun. Ever heard that word before? Um, no, but so the basic idea is that God created the world imperfect and it is up to us through our process and through our lifetimes to make the life perfect, to make God's creation even more perfect, which means that we all have to fix ourselves in order to fix the world around us. Okay. Now, whatever a person needs to deal with in their lifetime is their business with God, which means nobody has the right to come to tell anybody 
what they should do with their life. It is between them and God. That goes for all the Bible thumpers, all the people who use religion to explain that this is forbidden. In the end, whatever a person has to go through in their lifetime is their business with themselves and with God, and nobody else has any right to dabble in it. It's up to you. That is the two things I wanted to say. Thank you so much for giving me the moment to say it, and I wish you all the best. You too, man. Take it easy. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. I did not know about that. That makes a lot of sense from the Jewish uh, point of view. I actually respect that a lot more um, than just saying it's immoral without having any reason behind it. All right, maybe done. All right. Yes, I am a woman. Oh, sorry. I'm on the 18. Oh, okay. I Take it easy, okay? Me too. I love accents. I love Irish accents, man. Gotta love the Irish accent. All right, let's see. Uh, comment in the chat if you want to go up. Okay. Only join if you think that being lesbian is wrong, please. If you don't think that it's wrong, please drop or cancel your request. I do love you, though. This person commented, and now they're not. What's up? How old are you? 18. What year were you born? You've got Wait, can really you hear me? My service is messing up. Yeah, your service is pretty bad. Um, how, uh, how, what year were you born? Right here. All right. Uh, Hello. Uh, go, yeah, get to a better place and then rejoin, okay? All right. Let's see. Let's go with, um, I thought I already talked to this person. It says recent guest. Hey, dude. How old are you? Um, 22. I actually, right. I actually been in here like before. Okay. A lot, a lot of times, like we talked, we talked a while ago, but yeah. Yeah. Okay. What was your reasoning for why being lesbian was wrong? Oh um, well, I just uh, believe in God, so I just think you know, it's just, it's just like for me. Okay, I'm just gonna give a rundown. Me personally, I believe in God. I think that you know. It should be male and female and, you know, reproduce in the world and stuff. But do at the same time, at the end of the day, you choose what you want to do. So if that's what, if a person wants to be lesbian or whatever. Do you think you sexual do, orientation is a choice? What's the definition of sexual orientation? Um, I'll just give you the actual definition. Just um, so I don't misquote it. Uh, sexual orientation is about who you're attracted to and want to have relationships with. Sexual orientation includes GAY, lesbian, straight, bisexual, asexual. Uh, I think... It's I an mean, enduring personal pattern of romantic attraction or sexual attraction to persons of the opposite gender or ge or or gender, the same same sex or gender, or to both sexes or more than one gender. Sexual orientation. I mean, I, I guess I would think it would be a choice. I mean, I'm, you think I'm it's not a sure choice? That. I mean, I'm not too familiar. I'm not too familiar with, you know, that type of stuff. But I guess I would just assume that it is a choice. Okay. Would you, do you like to believe as many true things as possible? Do you like to, like, not have opinions that are wrong? Well, I mean, I mean, I just, that's what. No, I'm asking I you. I, don't, don't, like, go around it. Do you like to believe things that are true? Uh, Yeah. Okay, like that are backed up with evidence and that are like based on like science and like shit like that. Like you like to believe in things that are true. Like you don't like to hold an opinion that's false. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so do a quick Google search for me and like swipe out of the app and find me where sexual orientation is a choice. Well, I, I did I did earlier. I did earlier, but I guess the only stuff that I figure out was like... Thank you, Glow. The definition, like, it said something about, like, heterosexual. No, like, no, no, no. I want you to find me a source that says sexual orientation is a choice. A source being of what? A, a study. Source Just find me a study that doesn't end in dot .com. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I, I mean, just, find I me, just find me Just find me. a study where, um, where it says sexual orientation is a choice. Would I get kicked out if I did that? No, brother. No. You, if you swipe out, well, you'll still be here. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll be waiting. Don't rush. Take your time. How's everybody doing in the chat today?
Thank you, Tyler, and thank you, Faith, for the roses. Can you hear me? Yeah. Did you find something? I, mean, I, saw, I saw something that said, like, PlannedParenthood.org. I don't know if that. I don't, I don't know if that's a good source. That's fine. Um, what did you look up? <laughs> I just looked up sexual orientation is a choice. Okay. And then it brought, can you read it brought me? Up, like, can you read me from your your screen? Like, uh, what exactly you clicked on? Uh, what what do you what do you mean like 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 the title of the the study? Uh, it just the website's just plannedparenthood.org. Or I... By the way, I can't hear you if you leave. But uh, when you come back, just read me the name, the top, like the top words from it, at the very top, the title words. orientation straight meaning so that that's what say, that's say that this, wait say that uh, one more time i couldn't hear you because you were gone what did it say? sexual or sexual orientation straight meaning and then below it just had, had like plan pair and then plan parenthood.org and stuff so it brought up like reddit and a whole bunch of stuff but well did you click on said, any like, of them that say that it's a choice i uh, i just looked up straight sexual orientation straight meaning that's, like that's what it what, what it I, means? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Brother, brother, I'm, like, like brother, I'm asking you to sh show me. I'm asking you to show me, like a source that says sexual orientation is a choice, like that oh, you chose so, to be heterosexual. Oh, uh, I'm, I mean, I guess I want to like be able to. I guess I guess my whole argument. Uh, my whole argument. No, 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 no. I, I want you to find me a source that says sexual orientation is a choice. Okay. Just, it's right, okay. Yeah. Like, take your time. I'm not going to kick you. Okay, but I thought that you were. I didn't want. No, like, no, no. Know, waste it's time. No, it's okay. I promise. I want <laughs> you to find a source. All right. You've um, been up here several times, so we're good. Thank you, Eden, for the roses. This SpongeBob music goes hard, y'all. Just saying. Thank you, DC, and thank you, Galaxy, for the roses. Okay. okay I do have Venmo. So, it's in my bio. Okay, so I typed. So I typed. So I went back. And I just typed in sexual orientation oh, as a choice. Thank you, Space, for the. And then the I scrolled. And, and then I scrolled down and it said those. Um, Thing of digital commons at PCOM or something. Okay. So this is is sexuality a choice? I don't know if that uh, I didn't even like go into the website. I just like <laughs> I just brought up the first thing that isn't like dot com or something. All right, so. Let's just read from what you gave me. So, okay. um, moreover, the review will um, analyze the results of some of the research methods and strategies used in these papers, such as twin studies, animal studies, uh, longitudinal, I can't ever say that word, longitudinal, um, where I lost my place where I was reading, sorry, studies and surveys. By the end of this review, the facts and analysis should support the hypothesis that sexual orientation is a result of a complex combination of one's genes, environment, and hormones. Also, the facts and uh, analysis should create a clear picture that one's sexual orientation is not a choice, nor is living a non-heterosexual uh, lifestyle. So it just goes against what you just said. Okay. Now, all right. Now, get getting off that. Which, you know, I so don't, do you do you concede that sexual orientation is a choice? Uh, I mean, I mean, sure. I, I guess I I just I don't do my much information about that stuff. I just go. Yeah, off. but I but I want yeah. you to like I want you to like if you're gonna say you think it's a choice, and I, that's why I asked you, do you want to believe right. as many true things as possible? Right. Do you want to believe the facts in something, or do you just want to hold a view and look silly? Uh, I mean, I guess I, I, I appreciate you, you know, bringing that stuff up to me. But yeah, I yeah. do, I do want to. Pin, okay, so going off for me, I guess. Now, a lot of times, 
when I've been being this live and stuff, you you do. I guess like every time somebody, I guess every time somebody says that, you know, they believe in God and stuff, you go off the point of okay, prove to me that the Bible exists and stuff, and it's so oh, the Bible's start, true, yeah. You you believe that the Bible is true? No, I want you to prove to me the Bible is true. Okay. If you're going to go off the Bible. Because okay. the Bible just makes claims. You have to go outside of the Bible and prove that the Bible is true. Like, for example, if I wrote a book with 50 people uh, 2,000 years ago about fairies, that doesn't make fairies real. We have to fact check the book, right? Just because a book exists doesn't mean the claims inside of the book are true. You have to prove okay. that they're true. Okay, so then going off what you're saying, why is it that every time when they do that, you try to bring verses up? from the bible but you're saying that it's you, called an it's called an internal critique but you don't believe in the bible so why would you exactly. say exactly it's called an internal critique i'm internal going inside of your no I, listen listen i'm going inside of your worldview and attacking your argument using your worldview but you don't it's believe an internal it's an internal critique yeah i don't but, believe in it but if you're going to pull up the bible then i'm also going to bring up if you're going to say that that being lesbian is wrong and immoral because of the bible i'm going to use another scripture and watch you fucking scour because you can't you can't like you can't say like in the same book that it condone uh condones slavery it condemns homosexuality okay, so like right right but you bring up the same verses you don't bring up not any, all the time i have yes, a shit ton yes. i have i have watched your respectfully respectfully too you're cool i like listening to you but respectfully you bring up the same exact you know why you know why with no you know why well no listen without without reading before read without reading before the verse i know the context no you don't because you just himothy himothy hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on and what context is slavery okay Okay, back then? Okay, listen, back no, then. No, 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 no. I don't give a fuck about back then. Well, you In what context is slavery okay? No, it, because it wasn't okay back okay. then when we did it to when we okay. did it to um, black people, right? Okay, it wasn't okay when we did it to black people, obviously right? Obviously, it's not okay, but also... Okay, so why does thirsty. time matter? Why does time matter? It doesn't matter if it happened back then. It's still immoral. And you're talking about an all good and so all what, just what, God. What's your argument? What, what is my, your my argument, argument is... If you are going to happen? say, if you are going to say that being lesbian is immoral, and in the same fucking book that it condemns homosexuality, it condones slavery. I don't care for your morals. It doesn't condone slavery. Yes, Just it does. That verse, does that, is that, it's that saying holy it shit. You want me to read you slavery. all of the verses because there's New Testament and Old Testament. It tells you how to own slaves, okay, bring, when to own bring slaves. Bring up in the New Testament. Bring up in the New Testament. All right. Where God condones slavery. All right. This is Ephesians six uh, five through nine. The sla slaves and masters. Do you have a specific... Um, actually, I'm just going to read from the NRSV. Uh, slaves, obey your earthly masters with respect and trembling and in si singleness of heart as you obey Christ. Where, where, wait, where are you reading from? Ephes Ephesians 6, 5 through 9. No, this is a New version? Testament. Uh, I just told you, NRSV. NRSV, what is that? New Revised Standard Enough Version. NRSV. So can you read from King James? No, because that's a fucking terrible Bible. Like you, like that's the, that's the most standard. It's the most. Yeah, I mean, I'll read it for you for you. But the this is like the most. Yeah. This is the most recommended Bible as NRSV. Yeah. Most most. Um, the NRSV is the most accurate Bible. Sorry. Why is it the most accurate? That's just what all theists agree on. Well, Thank you so much for the not, So you're saying that King James is not accurate? Um, I don't really like the King James version. I don't like reading in like fucking like this is like um because it oh. says thou and stuff. So you don't really like reading from it. Yeah, personally, I don't really care for it. But I'll read it to you anyways. Okay. Ephesians six five through nine. Okay, but uh, that's but King. J but just because you don't like it doesn't mean it's not accurate. I did okay. <laughs> you said earlier I don't, that I don't care. I'm gonna not. read you from the King James Version. Okay, then do it. Okay, servants be obedient to them that are your masters, according to the flesh, with fear and trembling and singleness of your heart, as unto Christ. Okay, so how does any of that talk about slavery? What are servants? Slavery. They're, they're talking about slavery. I actually if I think any, you know, genuine true Christian is a servant. You know, you're going to be a brother. The context, the context of this, that's the context. 
the con you're wrong. You have no idea what it you're talking is. about. The context I have of no this no idea what I'm talking about. Yeah, because you how, didn't know what how? Ephesians six you're five through reading. nine was. If you knew what Ephesians five um six that five is, through nine was, is, then you would have stopped me. Know. How do that I is. know what the Bible verse is, but you don't? You're you looked up the verses. You no, only I didn't. One verse. Homie, verse I pulled. For I you. have this verse up. I have all of these verses up. I have every because single verse. Because it's the same that, verses. Hang on, it's wait. I just want to know it's. I've never read this. I've never read this. You asked me for a new uh, New Testament. I read I from the Old I Testament. Say something. Go for it. I just want to clarify something. So AG grew up um, Christian, practiced okay, that, Christianity for twenty years. So matter. so when she's that pulling up specific matter. verses, she's not just googling something to support her argument. These are things that she's actually read. Okay, but um, she doesn't believe that the life. Bible exists. So why would you bring that? Why would you? Bring it's, that? I've already explained it to you, and if you don't fucking understand it, I'm gonna move on. When we talk it, about a debate, I'm right. working under your worldview, so I'm using your fuck. I'm, it's called an internal critique, brother. Look it up. Under your worldview, I'm working under your worldview. You believe in this Bible, so I'm gonna explain to you why the Bible is immoral. If you're going okay. to say that being lesbian is immoral, I'm gonna say, well, guess what? Your Bible condones slavery. Okay. So why the fuck should I believe that your Bible is moral? Okay. Working under your worldview. Okay, but that is like me saying, okay, so I believe I'm a Christian and stuff, but that is like me saying, okay, I believe in this, but I'm not, I don't believe that you the obviously Quran, don't, listen, you listen, obviously do not know, you don't know how debates work. I don't believe in the Quran, but I'm going to bring up the Quran in my argument. That makes no sense. Why would I bring up the Quran if I don't believe in it? Wait, you, that's, that's so like, funny. That you know what's so no funny, Hemothy? Hemothy, no, no, Proto, stop. No Proto, stop. Everybody shut up. That you know what's so funny is theists argue the Quran all the fucking time. Okay, they argue for, they cr they argue okay. the Quran all the time. You have no idea what you're talking about. Okay, when we talk about an atheist, stop talking for a fucking second. When we talk about an atheist and a theist debating, guess who brings in the fucking Quran? The, the theists. They talk about all of the different Bibles to prove the biblical God that is true over the Quran. The okay, Quran. First, first of all, first of because all, because it's Quran, you don't know how debates they, work. They worship a whole you don't other know, God. You don't know how debates a whole work. Other God. They don't worship exactly. The God what's the fucking distinction? Serve. Yeah, and what's the fucking difference? You can't demonstrate that your God exists over theirs. You guys both believe your God exists. Who, who's to determine which one's real? I mean, there is only one true God, but that's like that's me. your opinion. But demonstrate the difference. Demonstrate how your God is is, is true and their God isn't. Okay, it's it, our God it goes off based on relationship with Him. Oh, in Quran, oh. Talk, and, in the Quran, it talks a lot about how if our God is a forgiven God, their God isn't a forgiven God. Allah, your God is isn't. your God is not forgiving. He does mash G sides. Your your God is your God is horrendous. How? If you've been in here, uh, let's go to let's go to fucking Genesis, brother. Let's start. Okay. Let's start from the very first fucking book, right. Abraham and Isaac. Okay. You know the story of Abraham and Isaac? Yes. Okay. You think that's moral? I think that's moral. You think what what about, an all knowing God, God did to Abraham is moral? Well, if you read it, you would. Understand. I did fucking read it, and I know it. I know the entire context of the entire story of okay, Abraham so and Isaac. Otherwise, I wouldn't context? bring it. Bring it up. Me, you tell me the context that I that you think I would tell you. Tell me the context that I think you would tell me. Yes, because you're saying you're telling me. Okay, explain how that's moral, or whatever. And you said you're re you read in that in, in the context, but I'm telling you, you're not reading in the context. Okay, so how am you're I not, not reading read, the context? Not, what context am I not reading? That's like, that's like, okay, so I'm going to bring up something. That's like bringing up Job. That's like saying, God, okay, God. Yeah, and allowed, what God allowed Job God to allowed go through all, is fucking horrendous, being that God is all knowing and God knows that Job would stay there the entire time. And, the, and not, the, he it's, knows, it's he knows one, in your worldview, okay, Timothy, talk, in your talk, worldview, I, I know what you're going to say. Stop, stop, stop. In Ew, your worldview, Timothy, Timothy, holy shit. I'll in your you worldview, in your worldview, you believe right. God is all knowing and all good, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So then, applying that same logic to Job, it's fucked because First he knew all. that Job would be one. He allowed Satan to torture Job to the point of Job's wife said, "Turn your back against God." No, God knows all this time that Job uh, what was even the reason being for told. That? What was the reason for that? It was testing his faith. Okay. 
So and that's not all, justified so in any sense of the word. That's not justified. You're talking what, about an all good God wrong? that knows, that knows, that he knows if you would let me fucking God finish. testing us in faith. What is Because he already God? knows. He already knows because your he heart, right? He already knows he your heart. He goes off a relationship. By, by fucking torturing you? It's by torturing, torturing you? It's not torturing. It is torturing. It's not. It is, it it is, is torturing, not torturing you. Are you joking? It's your opinion. You think it's torturing. No. It's no, when we talk about fucking Abraham being tested, he said, take your only son who whom you love and take him as a burnt offering. You want to talk about that's not fucking torture. Abraham went all the way to fucking Moriah to sacrifice his own fucking son just for God. Even though, even though in your worldview, God is all knowing and all loving. It's fucking absurd. God went all the way, or, or, or Abraham went all the way going through this sacrifice to sacrifice his only son that he loves, e loves, even though God knows his heart, right? Because in your Bible, in your Bible, you know that God says he knows your heart. He, kn he knows you. But you're saying that he's going to test you even though he's all knowing? That's a contradiction. He's just torturing you. And that is torturous to put somebody all through that knowing what he's going to do. He knows that Abraham wasn't going to, he knows that Abraham was going to go and sacrifice his only son. But God made him go all the way to the point of putting his son on the fucking altar and then stopped him and said, and now I know your heart. But, like, but that contradicts God, right? Because God already knows that he was going to do that. Again, God already knows. he wants a relationship. Why do you need to torture us? somebody? Why do you need to torture somebody in order That's to have a relationship? That's not torturing. That's what Are you, you think joking? Is torturing. Are you joking? Is it not torturing jo for me to hold a gun, a, a pew pew to your head? Okay, Isn't that look, torture to hold okay, a pew pew up, to your head and say if you don't if you don't say you look, love me right now then I'm gonna shoot Google, you? Look up on Google the message of uh, the message of Job what it actually means. What is Brother, the I read it. What is I the know what it is. I'm looking at it. Obviously, you don't understand it. You Obviously don't. You don't. You don't. Because How do no, I not you're, understand you're looking it? at it because you're not looking at you're looking at it from a biblical perspective. I'm I'm looking at it you're from a, at from it an outside literal. perspective. Oh, why would God put me through all this stuff? Oh, why say, would this God is in your take book. my family? Oh, this and that, the third. You're not looking. You're looking at it literal as your own understanding. You're not looking at it as God's understanding. Well, okay, what Brother. was the reason? What was the reason why God allowed that stuff to happen to Job? What was the reason why God? allowed satan to do that stuff to job it's you got to look at it not I your know own why. understanding but god's understanding when you yeah look and at god it, who god's is it who god god claims to be an all good why. god god claims to be an all good god and will punish his beings just to be worshiped what do you mean it's it's not you think okay and, he wants and what relationship. relationship and what relationship do you need to torture them are you talking are you talking about if we don't worship him we're going to go to hell is that what you're trying to get no i'm i'm talking about job satan torturing him allowing satan to torture him it's just so that he believes in god more and what relationship is that okay if i fucking tell if i fucking <laughs> choke my girlfriend is that okay and tell her and tell her that um if, if, and by choking her that if she doesn't fucking love me and tell me she loves me right now i'm gonna choke you is that okay okay, okay. first of all that makes no sense second of all how first, does that not make first, sense that's okay, your god is doing answer, can you let me answer it no because let me finish my sentence your god is doing worse than that your God does worse than that. He literally told Abraham to take his only son whom he loves, or Job, to be tortured by Satan. Whereas even, even his wife said, curse God. For what? To prove that, that he's faithful to God when God's all-knowing and already knows that? It's fucking insanity. It's psychotic. It's psychological torture. It's damaging. But you don't understand that. And that's absurd to me. There's no conversation with you. Your last words and go ahead, because you're just a Christian apologist. But go ahead. If you're not going to unmute yourself, I'm removing you. I did. I did. I did. I don't know why I keep getting muted. I just because I was finishing my sentence. Okay. Now, now can, can I speak? I told you to. Okay. Okay. One, it makes your argument, what you said earlier, makes no sense. Two, How? Okay. Can I just speak? Well, please, if you're going to make please. a point, hold on. Please. Because you're... I will Hennessy. get to the point. If you make a fucking, if you make a I'm point, then, then make the fucking. Okay, go I ahead. I will get to the point. I'm just explaining. Okay, All right, go ahead. thank you. Two, what ended up happening to Job? He got ten times more than what he had. God will test you through things 
for you to trust in him. You have to trust in him. By torturing you. Listen. By torturing you. Can I explain, please? Please. Go for it. Can Go I for explain? it. Thank Go you. for it. God Tell me what I already don't fucking God, know. Because I already God know. Will no, you don't know. Just because you get yes, tatted, I do. tatted I on your neck, you're Hebrew and stuff, doesn't make you a Christian. You can't no. even say Hebrew. You're not even a Christian You can't even say Hebrew. You I'm not. I am an atheist. I'm an atheist. Okay. I, I don't believe in it for these very reasons. I got I don't believe in it for these very reasons. doesn't make you believe in God. You don't believe in him at all. Okay, sure. So that tat was meant for nothing. Really? Because I would just That's get Hebrew tatted on my neck. Life, you got tatted Hebrew, but yet you don't believe in it. So that tatted was meant for no nothing. Brother, I was a Christian. I was a devout Christian. That's why I got Hebrew tatted on my neck. Thank okay, you very much. Just when you that doesn't make you a Christian. You leave. You were. You're basically. Okay, that's why I had ministry groups. Okay, you can keep spewing your opinion. Make a fucking point. That's what it is. You're not Christian. You're I'm, not not Christian you I'm not a Christian anymore. I'm not a Christian anymore. Yeah. Cry about it. I'm not a Christian anymore because of this shit. Cry That's about it. it. The shit I'm reading to you that you're a, you're a Christian but apologist you over. you don't understand it. You're, you're I do it understand it. I understanding rather than God's rather. understanding. Okay, and what's God's understanding of torturing somebody for his benefit? I just explained it to you. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. And what fucking torturing? And what fucking relationship? Torturing. Okay, so how is it not torture? Okay, he allowed it to God happen. God allows I, that. God, God uh, allows that to happen. Exactly. He that to happen. And that's why I brought what, up. And that's what, what I brought up. up Abraham and he Isaac. Got ten times more than what. He so had. in order. So it's. So it's an. Uh. It's, so it's a. Um, what's the word? It's an. You need to um, prove by being tortured to God by going through tests in order to prove your faith, even though He already you knows that you're faithful God, to Him. But it wasn't by God. Um, Abraham like was by God. Abraham, was by Abraham, Abraham was by God. It was in Genesis. Abraham commanded Abraham, Abraham or God commanded Abraham to take His only son. I don't know why you keep saying that. Uh, what? Abraham. I'm talking about God Jesus. tested. You're talking about God Isaac. tested Abraham. Yeah, and. And jo and Job also God allowed Satan to torture Job. Okay, but you're saying God, it, he got tortured by Job. You kept saying that. No, he I didn't. didn't. Get tortured. I know he I didn't, didn't get tortured by God. He didn't get I, tortured God, by God. I was, was talking about allowed. Abraham, and I kept saying Abraham, bro. I kept okay, saying so I kept why saying are Abraham. You going off topic. We're on topic with Job. Why do you keep bringing up? Why you go? I bring. Off topic I'm bringing I, Abraham and brother. Isaac. I brought up both. I have brought up Abraham and fucking um, Job in both okay, the scenarios. At, what was the reason for that? What was the reason for? Look at it through. Look at it through. Look at it through God's yes, context. God's I have, context. and I okay, was. What is it? What is it? So if you have, yeah, what so, is it? So, so in, in your worldview, you believe do, God is doing it for the good, for the better good of the person. No, what's the context of Abraham of and Isaac? Since you said, oh, you have. They're, you test, the they're testing their faith, and then they get, they get rewarded for um, going through the torturous acts that God puts them through, and then God no, um, provides the them with things. of Abraham and Isaac? What's the context? What do you mean Since context you you of Abraham and Isaac? What's the context? What is the context? You said that you context have no, the context. Context of what? Context Abraham of Isaac, what? Of this story, Abraham and Isaac. What is the context of it? That God commanded Abraham to take his only son whom he loves to sacrifice him. And then after that, once, once God says, hey, hold on. Now that you've proved yourself to me, then God rewards him for being faithful. Okay. Okay, so why would why would that be wrong? And what relationship? Again, I'll ask you you again. And what relationship would you do that to somebody, and that be that be okay? Again, and to again. prove to prove your love to somebody, you have to abuse them. Okay, again, you're looking at it at your own context. Holy your fuck! You're a Christian apologist, so bad. It's, you're it's just horrible. explaining it. You're, you're just you're making. You're it's psychological abuse. Own, what, it I is psychological said. abuse. How that's do you not you see that? Think. That's what you. You think. don't think it, it is? is your own understanding. It is not. Okay, and what's God's, God's understanding? understanding. What's God's understanding of making Abraham um, take his only son whom he loves and to put him on an altar and sacrifice him uh, for, for the better goods of just having more money?
But look at the whole story of Abraham. I look just what gave he you was it. Able to do. Look what's able. He, oh, only because he only because he do. went. He yeah, because because he needed to prove by sacrificing his only son. That's what he needed to prove in order to okay. get rewards from God. You're not God. You're not God. So what? I, you exactly. Wrong, you're not exactly the whole reasoning. You're not God. So you went no. Okay, why? And uh, why so then why are you assuming? You're not God either. So why God, are you assuming? Obviously, God. So how do you know that God isn't that. evil? So obviously then how do you know God? God isn't evil. So then how do you know God isn't evil? Since he you also don't evil. know God. He is evil. How do you know that? So I can make a claim that God is evil, but you can't? Because you can say that God is good? Because you're not looking at the context. He is not evil. I just gave you the context how, how and you said okay. How is he being evil through that? How is he being and evil through that? And what fucking world is that okay? That's what you think. Obviously, no. Tell me. So you want to tell me the reason why he did that? Timothy, holy fucking shit! I'm gonna give you five fucking seconds to answer this question. And what fucking world is it okay to fucking tell somebody to sacrifice their son for you? And what world is that okay? And what relationship dynamic is that okay? That I tell my girlfriend, you have to sacrifice your son for me to prove that you love me and that you have faith in me and that you trust me. Pro and what fucking. Okay. Prove it to okay. me. I'll, and what I'm relationship answer, is that I'm okay? Not, I'm just not answer this. Seems like you believe that the Bible exists because you're... Moving on. What's up? Dude, you that, get... guy, that guy was annoying, man. What does? <laughs> I need a break. But he's right. Apologist, you, he is completely right. It is okay. It is okay. <laughs> What's okay? It is okay. All right. God is good. Right. I don't know how he's bad. Explain to me how he's bad. No, thanks. Hello? Hey, how old are you? 21. All right. You think being lesbian is wrong? No. I just have one request. Okay. Do you wish me to look on my parlays? What? Do you wish me luck on my parlays? Yeah, bro. What is that? What is that? It's when you combine multiple bets together into one big bet. Okay. Yeah. Take care, bro. <laughs> Holy shit. My fucking head hurts. Yeah, debates are arguments. But I, I just... I don't... I don't want to fucking argue with people who are so fucking dead set and not being able to see what psychological fucking abuse is. It's so fucking obnoxious. I'm not here because of God. Prove God exists. I'm here because of my parents had smacks and before that evolution. Thank you very much. <clears throat> Hello, how old are you? I'm 20. <laughs> Alright, you think being lesbian is wrong? Yep. How come? Because it's a mental illness. All right. So where in the DSM-5 does it say it's a mental illness? There's many sources that tell us that. All right. Give me one. There's a ton. There's a ton. Wait. Give me one. What are we going to do now? I'm going to do now. Wait, wait, wait. Sweet. Wait. <clears throat> yeah, BBC, CNN, Mind, huh? University of Utah Health. American Psychological Association, Psychology Today, yet another BBC, New York Hold on. Times. Hold on. Give me the exact source that you're referencing. Thank you so much for the hand arts and thank you for the finger arts. I just gave you the sources. I just told you. Brother, uh, give me the you. fucking title. Don't be fucking dense. Give me the title of the, uh, of the source. I gave you the title. You, no, you gave, me, uh, you gave me fucking... the. You're not. You're just naming sources. Give me an actual study. You asked me for the sources and I named them. Give me a literal study and the name of the study. Thank you very much. Okay. Those are institutions that you're naming. Give me the study. Those are organizations, brother. What the fuck are you on about? Thank you for the... You asked for the... Actually, the, thank you for the... Frame. You asked for the um, sources and the organization. I told you that and now you're just going to... Give me the name. Give me the name of the source that says it's a mental illness. Thank you very much. In a second. Um, National Laws of Mental Illness... And, You're uh, giving, give me the study. Holy shit, it's not difficult. Give me the literal study. Oh, no, it isn't. It really give, me isn't give me the name. Give me the name of the study. And give me the name of the study. Give me the name of the study. Give me the name of the study. Facts. Mentally ill. You need help. You give me the study. Help. 
Give me the study. Wait, uh, first of all, are you a man or a woman? I can't woman. make it out. You sure? Uh, I'm pretty fucking sure. My tits say it all. <laughs> Doesn't have a study. I'm really testing my patience today. It's first day back, everybody. Fantastic shit. I need help. <laughs> What's up? How old are you? Hello? Hello? Hi. How old are you? Hi. Uh, 47. All right. You think being lesbian is wrong? No. Absolutely, Absolutely fucking not. Period. Thank you Absolutely for giving me a breather. fucking not. Sorry for the F-bombs. I know that's not TikTok correct. I only got like the last five seconds of this other person that was on your live and I got so angry. <laughs> um, I heard that person say about apparently there's something wrong with your mental health. Yeah, you um, couldn't give me a source. Don't worry about it. They can never um, give me a source because it's not backed up by shit. Yeah, I, I, I am. I'm, I'm, I'm just so pissed off. I am just so pissed off. Let me, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> preface by saying this: I'm 47, and I do not always understand where LGBTQ is coming from, especially when it comes to trans communities. I'm still trying to wrap my head around it because I did not grow up with it. Um, yeah. Uh, so I'm, uh, but I'm, I'm like, it, it's none of my business. It's none of my business. Look, I appreciate I, you so much, Jess, but I am just looking for people to debate, but I love you and I hope you stay in the comments. Okay. Yeah, sure. All right. Take it easy. Okay. Bye. All right. All right. Here's, this dude's been asking for a minute. One second. Keeps moving. Here we go. Hello, how old are you? Hello, oh my goodness. I haven't been spelling the comments for so long. I got you, bro. I'm 19. Alright, you I'm think 19. being lesbian is wrong? Okay, um, acting upon it is wrong. Not the just feelings, no. Not necessarily. Okay, why is acting upon it wrong? Um, simply, it's because the God says it's wrong. Now okay. you probably want me to prove God is, uh, God is um, true. That would be, that would take too long, right? Um, I can go another route if you don't want to go that route. I can just say that why would be acting upon, why is it immoral to act upon um, a relationship, um, a a homosexual relationship? I get my, why is it immoral? I, the source of good and evil comes from God. God decides decides what is good and what's wrong. If God says something's wrong, then it's immoral. Is there so do you believe that do you believe do you believe PDFs are wrong? Um yeah. Well the Bible doesn't talk about that, so then obviously you don't get all I'm, of your morality from the Bible. Okay. I'm a you're, Christian. you're a Muslim? Yeah. Oh, even worse. Okay. Well so I have a question actually, I have a question. You're an atheist, right? Yep. What reason Okay, let's say there's a pedophile. What can he you can't say, say against that. him? You can't say that. Can you say what? You have to say PDFs. You cannot say that. Yeah, it's not racist to say Muslims. The the Muslim religion is worse. Wait, what do you mean I can't It would be say racist for me PDF. to say Islam is worse. How is that racist? What to is say it, that what, what, the Muslim religion. About? Muslim is not a race, y'all. You're talking to the me? The comments. I'm talking to the comments. Okay, um... Yeah, back to my point. I have a question. What reason or what arguments do you have against a PDF? What arguments do I have against a PDF? Yeah. Okay, so I can, atheist. in my own innate morality, I know that PDFs are wrong just from the psychological damage that it does to the child. No, just, <clears throat> just the feelings. Psychological damage the and feelings. suffering. What? Just the feelings. Just the feelings. Just the feelings. No acting upon it. Just the feelings. What? The feelings, if a man has um, sexual attraction for a three-year-old girl, four-year-old boy, do you have any arguments against him? Can you uh, put him down for his feelings? Um, 
I would say like um, typically when we talk about like things, it's kind of kind of same as like schmurder, right? Like if you if you have these feelings of like schmurdering somebody or um, have these feelings of a non-consensual relationship with a child, um, and you're not acting upon those, um, like, but let's say like I wouldn't know then. It's okay. So okay, I'm not gonna put word into your mouth, but you're, but you're saying um, it's okay for men to have these feelings it's not wrong no it's not it's, okay for them to have those feelings the same way it's not okay for a murder to have those feelings i would say that they need to be um like they need to be with the like somewhere else like they need um psychological they need they need immense psychological help but do you not argue for do you not argue that sexual limitation is not a choice i agree with that it's not it's not really a choice but yeah, it's I'm not a arguing. choice, and it also doesn't harm anybody. That's where my morality comes from. It's amoral. Whereas I can so tell you why, that being a PDF is immoral. So, well, why is the feeling wrong? Yeah, I still haven't gotten an answer for that. Yeah, because having the feeling towards a child who can't consent to you, um, that it caught that knowing like all, all of those things, knowing the psychological damage and suffering it causes to a child. Um, also, PDF is not a sexual orientation. What is it? It it's it's not a sexual orientation. What is it? Uh, they. I mean, in my worldview, they just need psychological help. It's like a schmurder. <clears throat> sexual orientation is anything that you... Do you know how many people are married that... Do you know how many people that are married that, um, like, that are PDFs? Like, it's not a sexual, it's not a sexual orientation. It's, t it's a fetish. Well, fetish is... No, fetish is something else. F fetish comes within a sexual orientation. No, it doesn't. It's not... Nope wrong they're, se they're separate things sexual orientation is who you're attracted to yeah if a pds is attracted to young girls very young girls how yes is that but not tell me where and tell me where in the sexual orientation in science do we classify pdfs as a sexual orientation tell me where you don't because you put you put them down that's what i'm saying Rightfully so, it's immoral. But no, it's it's because it's yeah, not a sexual okay, orientation. That, that's my point. It's that's my, it's not a sexual point. orientation. They are psychologically damaged and they need help. Okay, okay, but that's not really my point. I'm not. You can you can call it not a sexual orientation or blah blah. blah. That's not that. Because it's not. It's, it's not classified yeah, as a sexual okay, orientation. Uh, okay, okay. Don't also, being that. lesbian is put down upon. Why do we have that as a sexual orientation? You're up here. No, oh, no okay. I'm. Not, it's I, it's okay, illegal I'm in sixty eight fucking countries. Come on now. Okay. Okay, okay, just just hear me out. Call it whatever you want. I'm not going to call it sexual rotation. I'm not going to call it anything. I'm just asking you, do you have any reasons against someone who likes very, very, very young people? Um, he does not act upon it. He doesn't, he's not talking to them. He's not doing anything. He just, he just has the extraction. He's never talked to them. He's never done anything to them. He has never done anything against them without them not even knowing. He just has an attraction for them. Can you have a reason against can you put him down for his feelings since you said the feelings I wouldn't are know I wouldn't know the no, same way I wouldn't there, know there is. the same way that Calissa I wouldn't know I that a schmurder uh, protest okay, you can Calissa come I up would. if you want Calissa I would well what, what reason to have against me to put, to put me down let's say I would what? I, I should don't. study let's say Whoa. I do have this feeling you hold said on. you wouldn't know Scott face you said hold on let I'm gonna back up because I think it's absolutely horrific that you are comparing PDFs with um, uh, inherent orientation. So I have a study for you right in front of me that's gonna lay out exactly why it's wrong. Okay. Okay. Um, all right. I want you to look up. Um, the Steven, thank you so much for the five dollars um, for on Venmo. I appreciate you so much, Steven, or Stefan. Take care, brother. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. I want you to look up the neurobiology and psychology of PDF. I'm 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 uh, censoring my language, so you're gonna write out the actual word. Recent okay, advances wait, wait. Can you give me, and challenges. Can you give me ten seconds. Can you give me ten seconds? Just ten seconds. Perfect. One, two, three. Three. Just kidding. All right, I'm back. What did you say? Can you say that again? Yep. 
Okay, you're gonna plug this into your browser. It's called the Neurobiology and Psychology of PDF, but actually spell out the word. Recent, the thing is if I it's go from the it, NIH. I did, I did Recent advanced, what? Um, if I if I go out, then I cannot talk. Sometimes no, I that's fine. That you, you can that's go fine. out I want you to and you'll read still it, be able you're to gonna... hear me. So okay. go ahead and plug this in. And then I don't have PC, right. I don't have PC right here. Use your phone. You have a fucking yeah, computer can... in your hand. Swipe out. Listen to you're my gonna, You're still going to be here. Listen Swipe to my angelic voice tell you the study. Period. And then wait, you, I'm going to have you pull you... it up. Wait, or I could just read it to you if you don't. My voice is lagging out. Can you kick me, can you kick me in? Let me in. What? Thank you so much, DC, for the roses. Hello? My voice is like an elk. Can you kick me and let me? Like an uh, elk? What? All right, we're just moving on. We're moving on because I'm not... You can... Uh, you no, can your okay, one, this study does not show how to be PDF. This, this explains why, why it's, it's wrong. wrong. It, it, and it also... The reason I pulled this one up specifically is because this study shows the damage between <laughs> those who act on these feelings and those who experience the feelings. The, the psychological so the damage that it causes the individual experiencing the, these, emo these feelings and these thoughts and other parties involved. That's the whole reason I brought that up. So y'all are weird for saying that. Anyway. What's up, dude? How old are you? Yeah. Okay. Good. I mean, I'm good. How old are you? 18. What year were you born? Uh, 2006. Okay. You think being lesbian is wrong? <coughs> Sorry, yeah, I'm going to drink some water soon. Uh, yes. Why? Okay. Thank you for the W. I'm going to make a presupposition, okay? Or okay. I'm not told because I'm not English. I'm Italian. I just talk English. So. Thank you for the time. Can we agree that having uh, relationships, having sexual relationships, has two purposes? To unite your people and to give birth to new human beings, right? No. Why? I think it's subjective to each person what a relationship means to them. So, uh, for me personally, a relationship is companionship and love, but not everybody should be a parent. So, I would wholeheartedly d disagree with there are two parts of a relationship. One is having a child. That is completely subjective. And also, we can have children. Lesbians can have children. The same way a straight and fertile no. couple can have children. But regardless of that, it doesn't matter. It's subjective. So, every, every attraction is subjective. No, attraction is not subjective. I'm saying that the purpose of somebody's relationship is subjective. Mm. I will disagree. I will disagree from you. No, wait. I, I got drink some water. Okay. Take care, brother. Moving on. <sighs> hey, I'll do. Eighteen. What year were you born? Two thousand six. All right. Can you stop shoving your phone into the bed? Um, how um, do you think that being lesbian is wrong? Shut your lesbian ass up, man. Okay. Nice. So ugly yeah, looking. All right, moving on. Hello, how old are you? Hello? Bro's playing with toys back there. You're on the phone, brother. You forgot to pick up the phone. All right, moving on. What's up, bro? How old are you? I'm 19. All right. You think being lesbian is wrong? No, I don't. But I do have a question. Cool. What's your question? How do you feel about? I don't. I don't know if it's disrespectful or not, but but gay people encouraging their younger age. I said G A Y. Oh, G A Y. Okay, G A Y. For to encourage the younger age to be, you know, G A Y. 
So we're not. Nobody's encouraging. So where are you seeing not, any not, like? Not you, like not like. No, 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 no. But no, 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 I've no. seen. I'm, not, I'm asking you. I know, but I'm asking you. So when you say that we're encouraging, where is the encouragement, and what are they encouraging? No, I'm not like. There's just I've seen multiple people say and, that like, like let rallies, like let like kids be LGBTQ because they are. No, I mean, not like, so what, what not we're shoot, what we're shooting for, what we're shooting for. I know your question because I've been asked this before, so I'm not trying to be disrespectful. But yeah, I got the you. point the the point is is that we promote acceptance, and I was a lesbian child the same way that you are a straight child. If you're straight, I'm not gonna assume, but yeah. I'm just gonna I am gonna assume that you're straight. But the same way that you are a straight child, we promote acceptance and we want children to stop being shoved the heteronormative society down their throat, and that it's okay that if you like. Um, woman at a young age and you have time to figure that out without being told that it's wrong okay all right see i have i have nothing wrong with people i have you know gay family members there's nothing wrong with it if people say about god there's god says nothing about that in the bible so whoever brings that the original the original bible no you're right but in the the new bibles yes the new bible it's yeah yeah but yeah. well i appreciate you brother question. Yeah, you have a great day. You too, man. Take care. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you. Thank you for the heart me. All right, we're going to do like one more and then I'm going to get off, everybody. We'll do Tyler because he's been in the comments. I may go live later since I have my account back. Woo! What's up, Tyler? How old are you? I am 28. All right. You think being lesbian is wrong? Uh, well, no, I don't, but I have one question. Okay. Are you uh, driving by chance? I'm sorry? Are you driving? No, I'm not. I okay, am... Good. Uh, outside where there's a loud vehicle okay i got you okay just right. want to make sure oh that's cool well no i do have one question okay does it stink from the back or the front or both bro neither oh well see some people it stinks from the back some it, from the front so some people go both ways <laughs> take it easy tyler all right what in the world? Okay. We'll do one more, actual one more. Okay. The brain rot is for real. What's up, how old are you? Hi, I'm seven, I'm 18. You, uh, what year were you born? I'm from 2006, sorry. Okay. You're from 2006? Period. Yes. Okay. But my English is a bit bad but since I'm Dutch. Oh, I got you. I got you. Cool. Uh, I love the Netherlands. Um, do you think that being lesbian is wrong? No, because I am a lesbian. Period, queen. Okay. Love you. Take care. I bet you love Amsterdam. Well, you're young. I bet I know whenever you go to Amsterdam, I'm sure you have fun. All right. Maven along. We'll do literally one more just because. No debate. No debate yet. All right. This person's not loading. <clears throat> Only join if you do think being lesbian is wrong. If you are in the guest request and you don't think being lesbian is wrong, please drop, but I love you. Okay, moving along. All right, we'll go with Trump girl. Yikers. Hey, how old are you? I'm 19. All right, you think being lesbian is wrong? Yes, I do. All right, how come? Okay, I think being lesbian is wrong because it, like, basically it isn't what God intended for us. I am Christian. I don't have anything personally against being lesbian like i wouldn't ridicule someone for being lesbian but i just personally i don't think it's right because you can't reproduce naturally i know you can with ivf and stuff like that but you can't reproduce naturally with the same sex i believe. so are are straight straight and fertile couples wrong for using uh, ivf no because it's so so the, what's the woman so what's the relevant distinction what do you mean What's the relevant distinction between a straight and fertile couple using IVF and a lesbian couple For using me personally, IVF? You said naturally. You said naturally. 
Yes, because it's two women, not a man and a woman. I'd also like to touch what you were talking with that guy earlier. Uh, talking about with that guy earlier, I like to touch what on that. Guy? You said what he was other making guy? A, the one that was talking about PDF. Oh God! You were making an argument saying that you know you're an atheist, so like you go by your own morality, and by saying that, you're basically saying everyone is allowed to go by their own morality. Therefore, yes, morality, say, is morality is subjective. Morality okay. is subjective. You okay. know what subjective means? Yes, I do. Even your even your interpretation of the Bible is subjective, which means your morality is subjective. Okay, and by saying that, you're saying so. Therefore, someone could say PDFs are okay because that's no, their own no, morality. No, so How? PDF PDF isn't a morality. First of all, second of all, it doesn't matter because we use science and psycho and psychology to prove why things are immoral. V like like PDS, for example, we do studies on these things and prove why things are immoral. And so I don't need a God to tell me that something is wrong. I know innately why grape is wrong. I know innately why offing an innocent person is wrong. I know innately why stealing in some cases is wrong. I know innately why lying in some cases is wrong. Uh, but I don't need a fucking God to tell me that. So if someone else didn't agree with you and they said uh, being a PDF is okay because of their own morality, what what's your argument against it's, that it's not, wait, wait, they would just probably be a pdf themselves accept that would you yeah, agree we, that we, we shouldn't accept, that. accept that, that that's something that we should we should um challenge and try and change their mind about of being because a pdf we know, yes yeah yeah because yeah. we know that that's very harmful that doesn't follow any form of altruism that morality tries to follow so <laughs> For somebody telling someone who, who claims that they don't believe that, or for somebody who says that um, being lesbian is immoral, we would challenge that, right? Because two consenting adults, um, you know, wanting to have partnership and love and the same things as straight people, and it's been proven that it's, um, that it's an innate sexual orientation, we've proven that it's natural and that it's normal. So wouldn't you say that we challenge people's morality or beliefs when they are harmful? Yes. Right. Is being lesbian Case not closed. harmful? Case closed. No, it's not. No. Can you tell me not how it's harmful? All. How is it harmful? You, it's not right. It's uh, no, tell me, how, right. tell me how it's harmful. Thank you so much. Tell me how it's harmful. You can't naturally reproduce. And that's harmful? Because we can, we so so it, is it harmful for a straight and fertile couple to not it reproduce? Decreases population. Okay, and is and overpopulation is just thing. as bad? Is overpopulation just as bad as underpopulation? Yes, I would agree with that. Yes. Okay. Okay. So. Also, it, that doesn't cause suffering. Like we can have children. Is it wrong for a straight couple to not have children? If they can't, no, no, it's not. No, no if they is, can, if they can and they choose not to not have children, is that wrong? I believe that because God intended for us to reproduce, I do think depending on the reasons and the context, sometimes it is wrong. Sometimes it is a selfish decision to not have children. Selfish? I would say it's the, I would say it's not selfish. I would say it's really good that we have people that say, "Hey, I wouldn't be a good fit to be a parent, so I'm not going to have children." Yes, and that's why I said in certain context. No. You didn't it, like I did you just ran. Well, you didn't say what context. You should have said that. Okay, and when you said that promoting, it's responsible. It's responsible for an adult to say problem. that if they don't want kids, they're not going to have kids. Hanzir, listen to me, okay? You said earlier when you were talking with that same guy who was bringing up the PDF argument when he said, or maybe it was a different one. I don't remember, but he was saying how like you guys are pushing it onto kids. I don't. You know, and you said that you're not pushing it, you're just promoting acceptance. I don't, I think there's like an extent to an age where you can do that because children, they do not have the level of comprehension skills to be able to decide. Really, Trump? Mm -hmm. So then why the fuck are, is there straight couples in every Disney fucking movie? Because that, why would you be pushing it on kids? Oh, is, is that, is that pushing it? Um, a, a straight couple in a Disney movie? Because guess what fucking Disney movie doesn't have a love couple in it? That's how I'm saying. I agree with that. I agree with them showing men and women being together. So we aren't pushing it, but you're pushing us to be straight and we can't choose it. I didn't choose to be straight. And generally, we're straight uh, lesbian. LGBT, sorry. It's over sexualized. No, it's not. You over sexualize us. 
true. You guys do. We don't. I don't want you. We're not, when I think of like that, that's heterosexual fucking propaganda. I do not want my smex life out in public. I'm talking about a relationship and companionship. I it's me and my girlfriend the same way it's you and your boyfriend. You guys are the ones that go. Well, what fucking? Are you guys? What do you have in your pants? Or you guys are having smex? Or you're works. the ones that are pushing yeah. it that it's smexual. It's not smexual when a straight couple is on the fucking screen, but it is smexual when a lesbian couple's on the screen. Why? Because I personally do not agree with it. We're gonna have but different. How is it smexual? What do you mean? Let's go deeper. You can't say, okay. "Well, it's wrong because it's not right." Why? That's ex that's exactly what I'm saying, though. I mean, you're saying the same it's thing. A circular it's right argument. You think it's right. No, I don't think it's right. It's amoral. It has no moral significance, just like heterosexual does. It's no, not I'm right or wrong. It doesn't fucking matter. Right. No, it doesn't matter. It's not right or wrong. It's amoral. It doesn't matter. The same way my eye color is amoral. It doesn't fucking matter. Or if I put on shoes today, it doesn't fucking matter. Eye color and sexual orientation are not the same thing whatsoever. Yeah, they are because they I didn't choose natural. it. You can't choose your. Se they're both. You can't choose your sexual orientation. Thank you so much, uh, Ron. I, I, you can. What do you mean? It's okay. Give me a source that says sexual orientation is a choice. What do you, you can? Okay, okay. So if no, you, go scroll out. Nope. Don't don't keep speaking. Scroll right. out and find me a source that says sexual orientation is a choice. I don't think I can do that. Why? <laughs> well, I'm about to go look up what is sexual orientation a choice. Yes, go look it up. Don't you want to believe in things that are true? You don't want to believe in look this silly. Do you want to do you want to believe in things? Do you do you act on it? Do you want to believe in things that are true or not? I believe in what I believe in. Okay, without and you don't want to believe in things that are true. If I think it's true, then that's what it is. Just like the same way you <laughs> think lesbian is being right. My shit's backed up in science and logic. I have studies that back up my claims. I don't just believe I them without fully, without I backup. I agree or believe in science either, so that's not helping your case. Yeah, I know because you believe in a god that's not fucking real. You believe in a fairy tale. You so I, yeah, I know that. Real. You don't think he's real, and you're gonna. Get yeah, shoddy, off. because there's no evidence of it. Evidence? There's no e evidence of God's existence of a supernatural being. There's nothing. And there and there's nothing to back up the Bible either. Come on now. That's just what you think. No, okay. that's based off of literal like archaeological evidence. Like w this has been like the 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 argument of the fucking like since since like for hundreds and hundreds of years. Okay, let's say Is the right. Bible okay, true? Does God exist? Right. Atheist right. versus theist. Let's say you're right. Why does the majority of the population of everyone on Earth believe that there is a God? That there is because they're indoctrinated. Back? Because y'all are coping. And also, it's not the yeah. Because you're indoctrinated. Do you know what the definition of indoctrination is? Or could I not say the same exact thing about you and how you? No, say because I grew up Christian. Life? I grew up Christian. Uh, the, the people that don't grow up, that, that grow up Christian, the majority of the atheist population didn't grow up, they, or they did grow up Christian, they grew up religious, and they came out of it because they realized how illogical it is. Uh, Sai, thank you so much no, for the cap. I think that they were just subjected to the false reality that the media portrays. Media? No, I found this on my own, I didn't find media. Media doesn't portray atheism, are you fucking joking? 100% it does. No, it doesn't. Where? Thank you so much for the heart me. It is being now in our... Hold on. Thank you, lady. Oh, and she was a fairy. Thank you guys so much for the gifts. I appreciate y'all. Oh my god, that was so funny. Alright. That's gonna be it for today, y'all. Um, I probably will go live later, maybe with Sam. Um, if Sam wants to go live with me. But, um... Thank you so much, lady, for the hand heart. I appreciate everybody. I hope y'all have a great rest of your day. I will um, probably post my story if I'm going to go live. Y'all take it easy. Follow me if you don't follow me. Um, I go live almost every day. Toodaloo!